another great update that Squarespace has blessed us with is the fact that we can now overlap blocks. Previously on the, the classic editor, we used to only be able to drag and drop and it would snap into place. So with our blocks, we could have an image block, then we drag another image block, and then it would snap into place next to the other block. Now what we can do is drag specifically to exactly where we want a block to go. And we can actually make them overlap and we can change which bit we want at the front. And if it's like, let's say three blocks, we can send things straight to the back and we can mess around with the layout until we get it perfect. And this is gonna be a really quick tutorial showing you exactly how to do it. To overlap blocks, what we wanna do is go into our editor as usual. Now, what I was trying to say, I couldn't really, couldn't really explain it without showing on the screen, but this is the classic editor. And if we wanna try and drag blocks, we need to drag and drop but when we drop, it snaps into place. And this only gives us a horizontal plane of resizing. And we can never actually stack things over each other without using CSS. So what we want to do is let's just create a new section. And let's do this. I'll just use any random section. So this is now Fluid Engine. You can see the difference is we have full control over where we drag. Whereas on this, on Classic Editor, we have to drag and snap it into place. So if we wanna overlap our blocks, all we have to do is drag and drop so it overlaps. So let's do this and it gives you the ultimate control in terms of how you want to lay out a page. So let's just lay it out like so. And then if we wanted, we could shrink things, we could shrink things down like this. And if, for instance, we wanted another image block, we duplicate that and we could add another image here. Now let's say we wanted this image to sit under this image. What we need to do is move backwards. And you can do this with all the blocks. So if you wanted this text block to sit further back, again, you can just move it backwards or move it forwards. And then you've got your shortcuts as well. So if you click shift and down or shift and up, you can move it like that with your keyboard. And you can, you can do this with all of the blocks. So this text block overlaps a few blocks, so we can send that back, 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 back until <laughs> until it's gone. But you can see that we have loads and loads of options when it comes to being able to drag, drop, and stack. So I'd encourage you just to go away, have a play around with this. You can even use some of Squarespace's new section layout. So if you add a section, you can see there's already lots of really, really cool jump off points to get you started, whereby we've got lots of overlapped elements. So go away, get creative, and create your best site yet. If you found this tutorial useful, please make sure to leave a like, hit subscribe, and check out all of the Squarespace resources in the description below.